The same Lucia Bureau of Standards has stepped up its surveillance due in part to an increase in the number of food recalls. The Bureau has also strengthened and in some instances established links with regional and international bodies with an aim of staying on top of potential recalls. McCabe Walcott heads the certification department in the Bureau of Standards. She says the Bureau also continues to work closely with the Department of Consumer Affairs to ensure good safety and quality. We have intensified um, not only our market surveillance program, which now sees our inspectors um, responding to these issues on a day-to-day -day basis. We also have intensified, intensified our import monitoring program, whereby we're able to sort of have an idea of what's been imported even before it lands in Sanusha. It has also um, seen us um, increasing our collaboration with other agencies um, outside of St. Lucia. The Bureau recently cleared peanut products produced by Associated Brands. The company that operates out of Trinidad was last week rumored to be using tainted peanuts from the U.S. in its goods. Walker says an investigation has shown this to be not true. We have done our reviews and have indicated or oh, verified that the products coming out of Trinidad, which are brands such as the Charles Chocolates, Sunshine Snacks, and the Devon Biscuits, um, are not affected. Um, we've received information from the company that they do not use peanuts coming out of America, and we have verified that with the Food and Drug Administration, both in the U.S. and Trinidad and Tobago. Walkers is also allaying fears about the contaminated American peanuts. She says companies who use peanuts from the Peanut Corporation of America do not ship goods to St. Lucia. Peanuts from that company have been in a state of recall for a few weeks. A lot of the product that has been affected in the U.S. are not products that you find in the St. Lucia market. A lot of it was wholesale peanut butter used in the manufacturing industry in the U.S. and fortunately a lot of most of the affected brands of products are not sold in St. Lucia. Walker says the Bureau of Standards continues to work closely with the U.S. Food and Drug Administration to ensure St. Lucia is not affected by any food recalls. That includes peanut butter. Carmi Joseph, HTS News, Channel 4.